This is the Cougar News. So that's exactly what he did. 
He went to the international for seventh and eighth grade. He continued to learn Spanish for both years. In the seventh grade, he started to take higher classes than his grade level. Then in the eighth grade, he had some classes with the ninth graders. He also decided to try something new and took a Japanese class. It is a difficult language to learn and takes a much longer time to learn than Spanish and English in his opinion. Once high school was right around the corner, he had the decision to either stay at the International or go to a different high school. He actually moved right in between Beechcroft and Northland. Northland was his home school, but he decided to go to Beechcroft. Since freshman year, he has taken higher level courses, trying to learn college, trying to earn college credits. Right now, he's on track to graduate with more credits necessary to graduate. Now it's time to do the most he can his last year in high school and have fun. Throughout his whole life, he tried to participate in every sport he could, including football, basketball, soccer, baseball, and track, field, tennis. He tries to keep himself busy and stay active in school. So now he plays basketball, football, tennis, and runs track. But no sport brings him any money, so outside of school, he works at Foot Locker, where he has been working for over a year now. You should vote for him because he brings energy and laughter wherever he goes to school. He can bring a smile to everyone's face, even the teachers. There's never a dull moment when he's around, so therefore he would be honored to be Beechcroft's 2021 Homecoming King. Vote Tori for BHS Homecoming King 2021. Now we will have the question and answer period with the candidates. 
Each candidate was asked to give two questions that could be pulled from a bucket randomly to respond to. So I'd like to call Ms. Harris up to the mic to go over the Q&A section with the candidates. And we'll start with um, Kanata White Crowder. We'll go the opposite direction um, in the alphabet. All right. Let's see. Bigger question. All right, Ms. Kanata White Crowder. What is your favorite thing about Beechcroft? My favorite thing about Beechcroft is walking into all the positive meetings and the nice vibes, the greetings from the teachers, and all the students and the places. Thank you. JJ? Why do you recommend doing extracurricular activities at your school? Why well, I recommend doing extracurricular activities is so your high school career is not boring. Do extra stuff so your high school career is fun. Do extra sports and all that. Antoine? What's your favorite memory at Beechcroft? Uh, uh, my favorite memory at Beechcroft is my uh, first varsity basketball practice. Uh, I got a jersey at first practice. Coach was turned, both team was turned for me. Torian. Who are your three favorite teachers and why are they your favorite teachers? All right, well, coach don't count, but I'm gonna have to give it to Mr. Dean, Miss E, and Miss Hess. I'm gonna say them three because all four years they really like help me out with everything. That doesn't matter the class, try to give me any help, and like we can laugh and joke all the time. Kanaya. What is your favorite cheer moment? My, my favorite cheer moment is becoming cheer captain. Karen. What is your favorite thing about Beechcroft? My favorite thing about Beechcroft is honestly the diversity we have here. Everyone is equal, and that is my favorite thing about Beechcraft. Tiwa. What is the best piece of advice someone has given you? I would say the best piece of advice I've been given is Every opportunity that you don't take is one that you miss. Thank you for answering our questions. I'm gonna pass the mic to Ms. Wright. Okay, so now's the time we talk about our voting and crowning details. So at the end of this recording, you will actually see this document. This document will actually have a QR code that students will scan. You'll only be able to vote once. You'll want to vote for one queen and one king. Please remember to hit submit at the end of your vote. And all votes will be tallied, so you'll be able to vote starting tomorrow on Wednesday after this recording is released um, until 2.30 on Thursday. Thursday during the game, we will have our homecoming court um, go across the field with their parents, walk across the field with their parents as their bios are being read. And then at halftime, we will crown Beechcroft's 2021 homecoming king and queen. 
This concludes our program today. Thank you for your attention. Go!